Hey CFD Esquimalt, it's Bike to Work Week. Here's a quick video tutorial on how to properly set up your seat height. The first method we're going to show you is the heel on the pedal. It's a quick way to find out if your seat is approximately at the right height. So jump up on your bike, place your heel onto the pedal, pedal backwards so that the crank is at 6 o'clock, your foot is flat, and your leg at this position should could be straight. Now you're going to pedal backwards to see if there's any rocking in the pelvis. If there's a substantial amount of rocking in the pelvis, it's an indication that your seat might be too high. Next we'll explore the inseam height. So how to measure your inseam by yourself, grab a book with a 90 degree corner and a pencil. You're going to place the book so you've got some tension on the groin area and then you're going to use the pencil to put a little mark on the wall behind. Once you have the mark on the wall, grab a tape measure and measure the height of from the ground to the mark. You'll notice that you need to take your shoes off to get an accurate height. Once you have your inseam height, you're going to add it to the board. You'll see Jason's inseam height was 80 centimeters minus 10 centimeters is 70 centimeters. On the picture below, we're going to measure from the center of the crank axle to the top of the seat and that height there should be 70 centimeters. Alternatively, you can use an equation. So you would take your inseam height, the 80 centimeters, and you would times it by 0 0.883. You'll notice that the value is quite similar, 70.6. So let's take a look at where the measurement is on the bike. So using your measuring tape, go to the middle of the crank axle and you're going to measure all the way to the top of the seat. That should be 70 centimeters. If your bike happens to have clips, you're going to want to account for the height of your clip on your pedal as well as the height of the clip on your shoe. This will require that your seat is adjusted slightly higher. If you notice you're starting to get some knee pain from biking, if your knee pain's in the front, it generally means your seat is too low. And if the knee pain's in the back, it generally means your seat is too high. So thanks for tuning into our video. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and happy bike to work week.